Hello, and thank you so much for joining us for Friends at Five. I'm Sonia Gutierrez. Andrea Mock is on vacation. And I'm Darcy Strickland. We start off today. A funeral was held for a South Carolina sheriff's deputy who drowned during a training exercise. 30-year-old deputy Devin Hodge died when his life jacket got caught on a boat propeller. British police have now identified all three suspects in Saturday's terror attack in London that killed seven and injured dozens. At least one, possibly two, were on the radar of authorities. Meg Oliver has the latest from London. The town officials say they had passed along information about the third suspect to British intelligence last year, but British officials dispute that. A government contractor is charged with leaking a top-secret NSA document on Russian hacking. 25-year-old Reality Lay Winner is accused of removing classified material from a government facility and mailing it to the news outlet. Some high school students learned the hard way what happens when you post inappropriate content on social media. Harvard just pulled the acceptance letters for 10 people. Thank you, Jim. The first Tuesday Republican Club of the Midlands held its monthly lunch on today. The guest speaker this month was State Treasurer Curtis Loftus. He discussed a number of topics, including pension reform and unclaimed money. It was a record year for taxing, spending and borrowing in South Carolina. And if you're looking for a place for your kids to spend the summer to have fun and learn at the same time, we've got you covered. We hit the road today to find some places that will help your kids learn and stay active. And cancer survivors got a chance to feel beautiful today with a full makeover at Virginia College.